When you think of librarians, what stereotypes might come to mind? Well, librarians from all over the state in Appleton today might just change your mind. Ryan Dietz explains. Librarians don't typically allow dancing in the library. Well, you know, the stereotype. Yeah. I hate to say little old lady with the bun behind the desk, stamping books. It's time to clear the air about librarians. I gave artistic 9.3. That's why these courageous curators took to the dance floor in the second annual Wisconsin Library Association Book Cart Drill Team Competition. The four teams take this competition very seriously, practicing their routines for dozens of hours. And when others find out about their sport, they say, Whoa, well, that's really crazy. What do you do? You uh, push carts around? Yes, pretty much. The technical was very, very nice. Nine more. These masters of the Dewey Decimal System were judged on technical ability and artistic impression. One by one, the groups took their shot at dancing with the carts, trying to impress the judges. The defending champions from Baraboo were last to take the stage. But I had to give them a 9.2. Getting mentally ready in the back room. Oh yeah, we'd be silly if we weren't a little nervous. This is high pressure. This is a state competition. You have no idea what we go through. But was the routine enough to repeat? Apparently no one has ever done wheelies with book carts before. Really? So I gave them a... The 8.5 for technical. The winners this year of the second annual WLA book cart drill team contest, and it's a repeat from a few years ago, the sensational Slissers. The winners this year hail from the University of Wisconsin-Madison. I think this year we were able to um, think through the, the moves a little bit more and add a little bit more panache. And their prize? A brand new cart with which to practice as the champions promise to be back next year. In Appleton, Ryan Dietz, Fox 11 News. Now the sixth annual national competition will be in Washington in June and the team from UW-Madison won that championship a couple of years ago.